Welcome back to Eratus, Lord of the Dead, folks. We are a little bit down on units. We had a wipeout in the last episode, so yeah, that didn't help much. And we have everything filled up here. No, we don't. Excavation is not filled up. So I only have the ability to create a bride and a lich. So what do we have? already we have a lich and we have a bride i think i'll create another lich we're probably gonna need it anyway and let's do common might Make i sure. use this one because that is a big mistake that i've been making is that i've been creating <laughs> kind of units out of a little bit better items that I wanted to use to upgrade to legendary parts so that I could upgrade my my units better so that's something I need to keep in mind for the next run through is that don't use my uncommon parts for making random units you might say okay so we have one talent point, but we don't want to use it yet because we want to get Relentless Evil here so that we can restore 8 Vigor if Iratus has at least 25, 75 Wrath. So we're saving up for that. We do are taking out the Book of Ancient Wits Wisdom, which gives Iratus 300, 300 additional experience after a victory. It's a one-time use, so we bloody well better win this battle which we're going into right now. Oh crap. We're not gonna win this battle, are we? Oh crap. You are gonna wait. And you are going to go into your stance. There is quite a bit of movement in this party. Ouch. block there there won't be any buffing or anything like that so he might as well start using his uh, hollow stare so let's do that he got a perk nice plus one dread not bad we're going to Stick down a poison cloud here. Oh. Hopefully driving him insane pretty soon. He busts up. That doesn't help us much. And then we're going to throw a warning shot on you. Pushing you into the cloud and driving you insane. Very nice. Oh. Very nice. Okay, then we're going to push you. Push you into the cloud. He dies so that Very nice. you can and live. Right him and saying, Betrayal, excellent. That's the one we wanted. Then we're going to stick down a toxic cloud here in the front. Decay. Getting him Corruption. all the way insane. Extinction. He's afraid. Very good. And you are going to go into your stance. Ow. Very good. Scream at him. He is insane as well. And you can hollow stare that guy. Hopefully killing him. Nope. Miss. Oh, miss once. He's gonna buff up again, move forward. He's gonna scream at him, but that doesn't do anything. Um, see, I wanna... Actually, I want you to wait. Because I want a toxic cloud here. Very good. Let's hollow stare again. I can't do it on him, right? Nope. So we'll hollow stare you. Toss them in. Very good. Heart attack. Heart attack. Being heart bold attack. Is my first mistake. Opposing right. me. 
Miss, miss, miss. Thank you. Okay. So now we need to set him right and get him killed. And you can't really do anything. You can't really do anything. Could do magic attack if we get you forward. Can we move you forward somehow? We can. Let's move you forward. That does mean that she can't do her... Kill, my darling, kill! For one. Wow. So I think I'd rather have her being able to... But let's move back. You can't really do anything either. But the Lich can. And do quite a bit, actually. That's fine. Next time we'll heal up. Knight him. We won't heal up much, but we'll heal up some at least. And you. Okay. And then there's you. You'll just go into your stance again. You can't really do anything. Miss. Thank you. Knight. Shot, sweetie. Nice crit there. And you go back into your stance. And you you can't heal up, unfortunately. That would have been very nice if you could do that. And bone shard. No crit, unfortunately. A crit would have been meant death. So please miss, please miss. My nope. hordes are without number. Dang it. You... Go into your stance, and you... Don't shard him. Okay, so we lost the Dark Knight. Mine but is that was the it. winning side. Got a brain, scroll of Skullfall, some rags, some armor, some flesh, Luminarium token for the Elite Stone Golem, and some Architect Souls. Okay. So the Banshee healed up, 70 experience Viratus, some rags and a heart, no ectoplasm, which we really need. You are going to get the luck here. Actually you're going to get the luck here. I expect results. Because we want to be able to stun maybe, and you are going to get, get this back one. To battle. For the possibility to insta-kill. Can we make a Dark Knight? No, we cannot. We are missing one ectoplasm. So what do we need to make an ectoplasm? We need two hearts. We can do that. Ah, the smell of right. successful alchemy. <laughs> it's all... Uh, let's just... I want to make sure... They will no, be expecting no, no. cannon fodder, but I will give them cannons instead. Dang it. Okay, I guess we can use this somewhere eventually. To unlock something, maybe? Not there. Not there. There's a statue. Nope. Arena. Nope. Crap. Okay. We do have a fully healthy leech, so we'll stick him in instead. Our Banshee here is now fully healed. So that's good. And we can take one of our leeches. Uh, doesn't really matter which one. And heal. Okay, you can go in there, and actually the Banshee can go in there because the Lich will heal up a little bit if it's down there, out of battle. Okay, and this Bride is level 2, it's a little bit healthier than the other one, so we'll do that. 
Okay. So we do have four talent points now, so we are going to get Relentless Eagle, <laughs> yeah. which I think it will, will help us out, out quite slaughter. a bit. Okay. We got the Skullfall. It's a one-time use, and I want to use it against the boss, I think. So we are going to go into this quest with this squad. All right. Order the beast killed. The unmistakable sound of a human being rendered apart draws your group's attention to a small cavern where a gruesome monster is feasting upon its prey in a bout, in a bout of carnivorous gluttony. Okay. It has the face and shape of lion, but its eyes are grown over by flesh and eye stalks protrude from where its mane should be. Rather than pause, the creature has human-like hands that it uses to handle its food. Order the beast quilled. Retreat back without alerting the beast. Success 40%, failure 60%. We're going to retreat. Yeah. I would have liked to see it, but I think we're a little bit too out of shape to, to go into to such a thing right now. So we're going to head on to this battle here. No golems, please. Thank you. Okay. All right, I miss good start. We have two elites, unfortunately. Well, we have an elite conscript, then we had the headsman and a doomsayer. So one elite. That's okay. You are gonna wait. You are going to go into your stance. Uh, stance. Where is it? There, A. Eh? Okay. Going to mark him. That's fine, I think. Every attack. Okay, we need to debuff that. Uh, we need to get that away. Hmm, we're gonna have to wait. We're going to stick this in here. Just a fraction of my power. Don't think we can get this buff off him. All right, so we have the cloud there now, so we'll push you. Uh, ward, of course, but. That ward is gone now, so we'll move him now. <laughs> Your cries are music and to me. That thing comes in there. <sighs> now. The trail, nice. <clears throat> now. You really need to heal up now. Uh, we'll stress you out. Perish. Pushing you in there, all right. Now He's that's insane. Gonna leave a trail as well, or right, he has cowardice. Ooh. All right, but that does deal some damage. He removes all debuffs from the Dark Knight. I really need to do that, but I don't want to pull him all the way back there. But I don't have a choice. Actually, I do. I'm gonna heal up first. Like so. Then we're gonna stick a cloud here. Taking away his ward. Your frail bodies fail oh, you. Crit, so we didn't take away the ward, but that's okay. And then we are going to push you. Alright. But that gives him and the ward. We take away as well. Very nice. Very nice. A lot of movement going on there. Ouchie. Ouchie, ouchie. Okay, we're going to push you into the cloud. Alright. Ouch. And he can't heal. So we're going to remove the debuff here and pull him back. 
and then you're going to stress you pushing you back into the cloud and then we're gonna stick another cloud here Good. Ashes to ashes. Nice. Dust. Dust. Fill him, and he is now out of. <laughs> nice. Alright, you. Push him into the cloud. And debuff him. Very good. Are we going to chance this? I think we are. We're going to do this physical attack moving forward. And hopefully we can heal up. You push you back. One nice by heart attack. One life vanishes from this world. He is basically dead. So let's not let him have a head of turn. Not lose a unit here. as you're suffering. Very good. Service Two exoplasms. Outstanding. And one of them is a good one. That was nice. That was nice. So the Lich is healed up. 70 more experience, a skull, and a weapon. See, we didn't get any artifacts. We will be using this it next time, though. It my undead features. All right. Our Banshee is now level four, which is fantastic. So... Hmm. Hmm. What do we want to give her? I think I want to give her... The block. Or maybe... Maybe the... Initiative. I think we'll give her the initiative. results. Can we make a Dark Knight? Yes, we can. Out of common items. To him, the world is as hollow okay. as his armor. There. And we do have a brain, don't we? Yeah, we do. Well, you get that brain, and... I think we're going to go with... Resistance on you? Or some armor. We're gonna Serve go with me well, my minion. Okay. This lich. I don't really want to use the brain on him. What do we have in the graveyard here? We have a fully healed lich. Level 2. Very good. We're going in there. And that is going to be it. Do we have the ability to unlock something here? I would very much like to unlock. We do. To, to get some more healing going. So we need to make a unit. Of some sort. Let's make... Let's see, what do we need for this a skeleton? Let's make a skeleton. Uh, of common parts. Hmm. Humans become much sturdier when you strip them. And off we'll their grab this. Stick the skeleton in there. Stick this in here. Infuse. Oh. Get some more healing going. And that will be it. Okay. Very nice. 
Wait, is uh, our other bride here? She's level 2 as well, but she's also slightly wounded. So we'll just leave it as is. And we did put the scroll of Skullfall in hand so we can use that. We have one talent point. I want to save up to get this as well. Yeah, I want to save up to get that as well. So let's go to the dungeon with our relatively good squad of units and head into the boss battle. Yeah. All right. Boss battle it is. Boss battle it is. Okay. So this, I actually want to wait until we have taken away his wards. So let's start doing that straight away. And just work on his wards. And I want you to wait. Stop. Okay, we'll put down the play cloud in position two. And you are going to go into your stance. I'm hoping you that's not what I was hoping that you would do. Okay, so now we can start pushing here pushing here. So if you push me back. Are you insane? Very this good. will be your end. Okay. He's insane. We can push you back again. Push you in there and now. Maybe you I'll are dead. This one into I'm standing. And that insta killed that. Good. And we do have more than 75 wrath now, so. We heal for eight, which is amazing. Okay, his ward. Let's stance it out again. At least one miss, that's good. And we will push you. He's insane. Excellent. His wards are gone. We got three buff. All right, so that pushes him back. Okay, we'll paralyze him. Ooh, this will him. Very nice. Bowels just Very nice. And he moved into the cloud. Ah, oh, crap! He got inspired. But we save these last few hearts. So he moves into the cloud. And he gets the Dark Knight. We'll stance again. Oh, stance. Okay. Pulls out a new unit. That's okay. Stick the cloud there. Very good. We will push you, oh, okay. <clears throat> pulling him into the cloud and dealing damage to him. Very nice. Then we will push my darling kill you again, push you out of the cloud, pulling him into it and doing more damage to him with the knight. <laughs> this is going reasonably well. We do need to heal up our Dark Knight now. Let's stick down another Plague Cloud. My kingdom comes! Okay. <coughs> Ow! That was bad. That was really bad. Okay, we're going to... 
Let's push you. Because that pulls him into the crowd. Ow! Alright, he's gonna buff now, of course, because now he's not in the stance. Let's Skullfall. Say hello to my burning friend. Them. It'll deal a little bit of damage to them and it will also do a bit of stress damage, I think. So you push you. Oh, you missed. Dang it. You are going to have to move yourself up. Entertainment. That does take us below the 75, but not for long. Still in another cloud here. Okay. Ouch. Okay. Now we can. Hmm. Wait. I think. Ah, crap! We stunned it. That means no new cloud. Well, then we might as well do this. Pulled him in there. You are going to go into your stance. And you are going to push him on the back into the cloud there. And there we go. And that pulls him into the cloud. Doing damage to him. He's insane. Alright, he's buffing. Good. Ow. He buffed, why didn't he do his thing? I wonder... Why did he not do his thing? You are going to have to wait. You are going to have to wait. You are going to put down your cloud right here in the middle. We're gonna heal up. You are going to push him back, <coughs> bring him forward, doing damage. You are going to move him. Push him one back. less annoyance That's in one the down. world. Alright. Ouch. I think, I'm guessing that he will get some more units in, yeah. Ooh, I hope there will more. still be enough All right, he's dead. He's dead. Keymaster is dead. Outstanding. Let's push you back. We got unfortunately inspired. Um, you know what? Let's kill him outright. Delivered. And now we can hollow stare these guys and so on. Because they won't be getting buffed again. You do that. Okay. You move him. He comes into the cloud. You push him back. So he comes into the cloud. Very nice. Whenever they receive a debuff, I suppose we are debuffing, but only one time. So I think it's better to just hollow stare here. Die. Nope. We'll put down another plate cloud there. One Open more for the yeah. stockpiles. And he'll be pulled into it. And he is... Dead as well. Ah! A bit still. But that was that really necessary? Seriously? 
I did not want to lose my level 4 Banshee there. I really, really didn't. Okay, but we won. We won the boss fight. Purging the world ahead of schedule. But we lost our level 4 Banshee, which really sucks. We did get a very nice flesh. Bones and stuff. Okay. So our Lich and our Dark Knight are fully healed. 70 experience for Eratus, armor and skull. Okay. So we do have that unlocked. Do we want to get this one? Or do I want to save up one more and go down to more parts, maybe? Hmm. I am not really sure here. I think I want this one. I embrace this fury. So we can restore full vigor to all our minions. I think having that would have saved our bride, I think. Alright, so our Dark Knights. Uh, what do we give him? I think we give him this one for another. My armor. enemies are in for a nasty And the next surprise. time we're going to be doing the hollow stair. And get this one, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Lich. I think I want to give you a board. Or... Actually, I want this one. Lich and all allies gain plus 50 bigger, and it gives him plus now, 10 bigger as well. Prove yourself worthy and then we have level 3 Bride, who we're giving luck. My enemies are in for a nasty surprise. Okay. That'll work. Okay, so do we have another Banshee? We do. A level 3 Banshee. So that's something. Do we have a Lich? We do. And we do have a Dark Knight as well. Alright. That's actually pretty okay. That is actually pretty okay. Ooh, achievement unlocked. Cursed creature. A street achievement unlocked. Blind rage. And we have unlocked the mummy. Okay, very nice. What abilities does that have? Curse deals 50%, 8 to 10 damage. And the same for two turns. Physical attack deals 120% damage and the target loses 10 luck. Another stress attack does 60% damage to the chosen target and the enemy standing behind it. That is actually very nice. And a support removes all debuffs from allies. The mummy gains plus five bigger for each debuff removed. That's really nice too. Then another stress attack. Deals 50% 8 to 10 damage. Deals additional 11 to 14 damage if the mummy has a debuff. Okay. And then the ultimate stress attack deals 200% stress attack. Additional deals one stress damage for each point of negative luck that the target has. Okay, the mummy seems pretty potent. The mummy seems pretty potent. And it uses parts that we are pretty good on. 
No ectoplasm, that's nice. Skull, we have plenty of skulls. We don't have that many bones. Flesh and rags, okay. The mummy seems pretty potent. Then we have the headhunter here. So dual slash, physical attacks, attack two random enemies dealing 60% damage to them. Does a lot of damage, look at that. What did the mummy have for stats? 13, 17, 15 to 19. No armor or assist, but a ward and a block. Some luck, no evasion and reasonable accuracy. So the headhunter has very, very, very both attack and dread. 80% accuracy, so that needs to go up. 12% luck. Very good initiative. And four armor. So it's kind of a frontliner, I guess. So let's uh, look over these other abilities here. So we looked at dual slash. Then we have catch him. Physical attack deals 80%, 12 to 24 damage to a random enemy and moves it to the first position. Okay. Uh, stress attacks deals 150%, 21 to 30 damage to a random enemy. Okay, mark selected position. At the beginning of his next action, the headhunter deals 100%, 15 to 30 physical damage My to him. any enemy can be made at the better. marked position. Attack Dead doesn't here. spend an action. The headhunter doesn't miss this attack. That's pretty cool too. Physical attack deals 6 to 12 damage to each enemy, 40%. And then the bounty deals 200% damage, ignores block. Okay. I think that's two pretty cool units that we've unlocked here. Pretty cool units. Unfortunately, they don't really move the others around anyhow. But they could be very, very useful. They could be very, very useful. Okay. So before we end the... Episode, let's move in to the next area. We beat the boss here. So, okay. The hunger for wealth had long since become the only virtue among the hardy dwarven folk. Gone are their ancient traditions along with the names of their ancestors for, for what was more powerful, logic or some dead dwarf rotting away into dust. Their ruthless scientists and alchemists knew the answer to that question, and the human, king human kingdom was more than willing to facilitate their experiments. They have grown rich and feared, setting up their own enclave and became the default overseers of the mines. Okay, so we're up against dwarves now. Alright, let's have a quick... Actually, let's have a quick look at the dungeon at the beginning of the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope that you appreciate that we finally beat the boss. And uh, yeah, if you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.